Hey, Amanda here, the Consistency Queen with another video. And today we're gonna to be discussing how you as a real estate agent can generate free leads. I'm gonna be talking about my top five tips on how to get free leads. Number one is going to be your sphere of influence, okay? Especially if you are just starting out in a brand new agent, you need to contact every single person that you know, all family and friends, and let them know what you're doing. Let them know that you're in real estate. Get connected with them, stay connected with them. You wanna be top of mind of your sphere at all times. Number two is cold calling. It is definitely not easy and it is a lot of work, but you can definitely get a lot of leads doing cold calling. Now, if you are in Canada, make sure that you are checking the do not call list and not calling anyone that is on that list because that is not allowed. And another thing I would recommend is definitely using a dialer. Why? Because it's gonna save you so much time and it's gonna help you to get a lot more done and actually get it done because you know, a lot of times we're afraid to cold call, right? It's not the most, you know, pleasant experience. And so if you're on a dialer, you don't even have time to make an excuse or, you know, take five, 10 minutes just to call the next person because you're using a dialer. Number three is open houses. This is great for getting new buyers. So the great thing about open houses is if you do have a listing, your seller is gonna be very happy for you to actually run an open house. And it's even better news for you as the realtor because now you have the opportunity to get free leads. Honestly, anyone that has a listing, there is no reason why you can't turn that one transaction into two or three transactions just by doing an open house and getting buyer leads. Number four is gonna be building relationships, okay? You should be talking to everyone. So anytime you overhear anyone talking about real estate, buying or selling, you should be introducing yourself and talking to everybody. Also take advantage of networking events. Now, you don't necessarily want to go to real estate networking events because think about it. The people that are there are usually like lenders, title companies, you know, these are people who want your business. It's not going to be an opportunity necessarily for you to gain more business. So it makes sense not to really target real estate specific networks networking events, um, but use other networking events that make sense in your area where you can meet new people. Number five, I left the best for last, is social media, okay? And I don't mean using paid ads, obviously, because we're talking about how to generate free leads. I'm talking about just building your brand online on these free platforms. So you should be using social media in two different ways. One, you can actually prospect on social media, and I'll talk about that here shortly. And number two is just focus on continuing to build your brand. Now, if you wanna last in this industry, the people who have built a personal brand are the ones who are gonna last. It's also what's going to allow you to attract clients coming to you at all times. Now, if you're just starting out and you wanna use social media for prospecting, you can definitely do that. And the easiest way to do that is simply just you know, putting out content that is valuable to whoever your target audience is. And along with that is also actually making friends on social media, building relationships online. And you can do this by searching your area, either a hashtag or location, looking for people to connect with, going on their page, like and comment, meet, leave meaningful comments. And then soon enough, you guys will be following each other and building a relationship. And if you just continuously provide value to your followers, aka your potential clients, and you continuously build relationships with them online, eventually they will start using you. That's gonna be it for today's video. I want to keep it nice, short, and clean. If you guys do have any questions, let me know in the comment box down below. And if you could, hit the like button if you liked this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my page yet, click the subscribe button right now. All right, that is it. I hope you guys all have an amazing day and remember, do the impossible.